y'all. Welcome to Michelle's Tasty Dishes. Today we are making an Italian meatloaf slow cooker style. Join me in the kitchen. All right, guys, here we go. This is an Italian slow cooker meatloaf. Um, and this is the seasoning pack that we're going to be using. I sell these, so you can contact me to get um, different kinds of packets for meatloaf, soups, dips, all kinds of stuff. So we're going to use this today, and this is a slow cooker Italian meatloaf. My hands are clean. I just washed them before getting started. But you're going to use two pounds of hamburger meat or turkey meat, whichever you prefer, or you can mix it. <clears throat> then to this, we are going to add one beaten egg. We're going to add the seasoning packet. Oh, the smell is just yum. It smells so good. So you're going to add that in there. So this is nice. All your seasonings, you know, everything comes in this, so you don't have to worry about adding anything extra. It's all in there. Then you're going to add a cup of your favorite um, spaghetti sauce, marinara sauce, uh, whatever you enjoy using. So we're going to mix that in there. Also going to need cheese for the top and about three tablespoons extra of whatever sauce you're using. This is a sauce that I'm using. This is very, very good and it's no sugar added. So if you are keto, low carb, this is perfect. And we'll have some of that extra because I think on the side we'll have um, some pot, little pasta and a salad. And yes, I'm using my hands because when doing meatloaf, this is the best tool to use, is your hands. So you just wanna get all that seasoning co uh, cooperated in there, very good. I'm going to make a um, Italian little salad with this. And then, like I said, maybe some pasta. Pasta, what's that rest of that marinara sauce? Not sure yet on that part. May just be salad. I see what my husband wants. But yeah, just keep, you know, blending this all together till you get, you feel like you have your seasoning mix all the way through there. If you haven't yet, please go subscribe to my channel. Um, I will have more meals like these from the, um, you know, the soups, the stews, the different meats, the um, dips, um, pies. I mean, a key lime pie that is included in my dips. And so you can look for that. This week I'm also going to do a lemonade pie. So make sure you subscribe and ring that little bell so you get notified um, when I'm putting new recipes up. And like, if you like this recipe, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment. All right. So I'm gonna put this in, this crock pot is my smaller one. So you just want to make that into, you know, a meatloaf size. Now you can put foil down in your crock pot, easy cleanup, let it lay over the edges and you will be good to go. So just kind of form that in there how you want it. Then I'm going to wash my hands really quick.
But yes, a lot more recipes coming. Soups, stews, enchiladas, some casseroles. So you want to make sure that you subscribe and hit that bell. And then I also have a Facebook page um, that you can check out. That is also Michelle's Tasty Dishes. Please come over and join there because I do do some lives there. And I do giveaways there. So again, that's Facebook, Michelle's Tasty Dishes. I'm gonna go ahead and turn that on low. You're gonna cook this for seven, six to seven hours on low. All right, I gotta wipe this up. All right, next is about three tablespoons of that um, tomato sauce, uh, spaghetti sauce. And you are just going to dump that on top. Take my little dip spoon that I used and kind of spread that over it. And then let me see, when are we gonna do our cheese? We're gonna do some cheese now. So just sprinkle some mozzarella on top. And when it's almost done, you can come back and put a little bit more if you want. See how much of it is melted in. If you want more, you can do that. And that's it guys. All you have to do is put your lid on, turn it on. I got powder from my pack on there. That drives me crazy. But go ahead and subscribe, hit that bell, and I will be back in about seven hours when this is done and show you what we're going to serve it with and how we are going to plate this baby up. So thanks for watching. I'll be back in a little bit. All right, welcome back. We are finally into seven hours of this cooking and we're gonna take a look. Um, I actually came in about five minutes ago and put some extra cheese on top. But there it is. Delicious. I will show you what we are having with it and I will plate it up and I will be back with the pictures in a second all right guys here you go it is the italian slow cooker crock pot meatloaf look you can see all them herbs and spices and stuff from the packet in that meatloaf that makes it delicious we just made some spaghetti i tossed it in the rest of the leftover spaghetti sauce and then a salad with a homemade dressing this was a great combination and delicious Make sure you subscribe, hit that bell, give us a like, comment, and share. And if you're interested in these packets, just reach out and let me know. God bless.